हेलो एवरी वन आई एम ए बी गवरी डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ इंग्लिश जी के जी कॉलेज कोल्हाप क्लास बी कॉम सेकेंड सेमिस्टर थर्ड सब्जेक्ट इंग्लिश फॉर बिजनेस कम्युनिकेशन कंपलसरी इंग्लिश इन द मॉड्यूल फर्स्ट ऑफ दिस सेमिस्टर वी स्टडीड द यूनिट ओरल स्किल्स In that unit, we learn what are the oral skills, spoken communication and written communication. Difference between spoken communication and written communication. Oral presentation. Comparing PowerPoint presentation. Language of PowerPoint presentation and interviewing famous persons. Similarly, in this unit, we will try to learn conversation skills. The topic of today's lecture is conversation skills, module two, unit one. So let us see what. are the conversation skills language is a means of communication in a multilingual country like india english is used as a link language conversation is not only a matter of giving and receiving information but a form of social interaction too we communicate with others by using various concepts dealing with request permission agreement and disagreement we use polite language while expressing requests asking for information seeking permission etc the present unit focuses on conversation skills like self introduction asking for information making requests seeking permission expressing agreement and disagreement a learner can achieve these skills through practice so the first point of today's unit is introducing yourself introducing oneself is a way to connect with someone not earlier known by exchanging words and often through physical contact you may introduce yourself differently at various situations it depends on whether you are addressing an audience meeting and class or just stating a conversation with a new person it is very important to introduce yourself in an appropriate way which will influence people while introducing yourself keep in mind the following important hints make eye contact with those around you eye contact is a way to connect with another person and it shows that you are open and engaged keep a genuine bright smile when you meet a new person stand with your head high and your back straight your body language should show that you are confident and at ease exchange names when the introduction is formal for example hello i am sangeeta desai if it is informal say hi 
आय एम संगीता देन आस्क फॉर द अदर पर्सन्स नेम वॉट इज युअर नेम आफ्टर लर्निंग द अदर पर्सन्स नेम रिपीट इट बाय सेईंग नाईस टू मीट यू अशोक सो ॲज वी हॅव स्टडीड इन द अर्लियर लेक्चर्स द फॉर्मल अँड इनफॉर्मल लँग्वेज सिमिलरली इन द सच टाईप ऑफ कॉन्वर्सेशन यू हॅव टू यूज फॉर्मल और इनफॉर्मल लँग्वेज अकॉर्डिंग टू द पर्टिक्युलर सिच्युएशन नेक्स्ट पॉइंट इज आफ्टर इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफर अ हँडशेक और अदर Culturally appropriate greetings. For example, join your hands. Then ask questions about his general personal details. Ask where he is from. What he does for living. What he loves to do etc. You can ask such type of questions. during conversation after this you may tell about your background tell him where you work or what you love to do which may lead more conversation topics close the conversation by saying that you enjoyed the meeting and when the interaction is formal say mrs desai I am delighted to meet you. I hope we can talk again. So, these are the tips you must know in order to do your conversation effective. Let us see one example of informal dialogue of two persons, Meera and Suhas. मीरा सुहास धीस इज माय सिस्टर मेगा शी इज अ टीचर इन शारदा स्कूल मेगा मीट सुहास सुहास हाय मेगा इट्स नाईस मीटिंग यू टू सो धीस इज अ एक्झाम्पल ऑफ इनफॉर्मल डायलॉग नाव वी विल सी द एक्झाम्पल ऑफ फॉर्मल dialogue between two persons introducing yourself at a professional event mr trivedi hi i am arvind trivedi good morning i am a project manager i work with microfinance organization i help them expand their market base in developing countries mr roy good morning i am happy to meet you i am rajiv roy and i am manager in the housing loan division welcome to our bank mr trivedi thank you mr roy very nice to meet you this is a example of formal dialogues so students in this way you have to keep all these points in mind and increase and develop your conversation skills through this lecture and the book of your subject in your book page number 26 27 some examples are given which you can try to read and understand what kind of language and dialogues and conversation examples are given with the help of this information you can improve your conversation skills in the next lecture we will see the next point of this unit conversation skills thank you